The range topping P5 31st edition swaps out all of the fuel saving hybrid stuff for a full bore, pedal to the metal twin turbo 4.4 liter V8. It produces 523 horsepower and 533 pounds to foot of torque, only 5 more HP than the previous model's 5 liter V8, but torque from the new motor is up about 70 pounds to foot. Standard specification for this first edition model is extensive and includes 4 zone climate control, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, auto deploying door handles, adaptive air suspension, 23 inch alloy wheels, carbon fiber interior trim, and an electrically deployable tow bar. A head up display, keyless entry, leather multifunction steering wheel, a 13.1 inch touchscreen, 22 way power front seats, tough and rear and side glass, tire pressure monitoring. A twin speed transfer box and wireless charging are also standard. Land Rover also says that an all electric Range Rover Sport is due sometime in 2024. An adaptive air suspension comes standard on every Range Rover Sport, and thank goodness. It would be worth shoveling out extra bucks for as an option, but Land Rover has spared you the effort. The result is excellent ride quality. Even riding on enormous 23 inch wheels, which do produce some bumpiness now and then, the worst road conditions are kept in check by this cushioning technology attached to all four wheels. On smooth roads the ride is simply great, the Sport is more composed than the larger full-size Range Rover with all that extra weight to lug around. The only noise consistently allowed inside the cabin is from wind at highway speeds, and even then, some light tunes or a good conversation will easily drown it out.
Thank you for watching and don't forget to like, subscribe, share.